Hey, Volrath here. Uh, today we're playing Coats, which is advertised on its uh, project page as a game of desperate research. And that's, uh, that's no joke. Research is a big part of this game. And what we're watching here is a series of scenes that introduce, um, you know, the sort of apocalyptic event that uh, inspires all the research. And... Uh, there's so it's it's a bit like a, a zombie movie with these people who are losing their skin. Um, there, there's some differences, um, but it's basically you know those in broad strokes. It's like a zombie invasion kind of thing. Uh, they call them skins, and I think probably the um, the creator would have named the game Skins if it weren't for the uh, you know there's some British TV show about teenagers that's all sleazy. I think it's got that name, so he probably didn't want that association. Um, we have Randall here, who is the um, the leader of the uh, small research facility that's working on this, and um, he's just getting the news that the sort of skin epidemic is out of control. Uh, they were just talking about it in the last uh, scene, and if you ever watched any of this stuff, um, you know every time they talk about the apocalypse, you know in a very sort of serious way, uh, it always happens right after. Um, so we're letting these two in. They're right outside the uh, the fortress and. Um, Randall is very uh, nice and lets them in. Um, so, and we'll be glad they did because they contribute to the to the effort. And after these scenes are over, the game gets into this um, cycle of, of days, this daily routine of, uh, str of making sure the defenses are good, um, you know, sort of controlling your ammo and your food and uh, doing the research. And it doesn't necessarily sound fun when I put it like that, but it is a lot of fun. This game is a lot of fun. Um, so we've got all these characters gathered around, uh, most of whom work at the lab. And at first, you know, you meet them all, you meet them all at once. You're like, oh, I, you know, I can't tell this guy from that guy. But um, the nice thing about this game is that because you do, you, know, you start doing these these daily rituals, um, you meet them all, and they start to uh, you know stand out. And um, and that that's good writing. I mean, the writing of this game is generally pretty good, definitely above average, um, as far as RPG Maker stuff goes. And uh, so this is, you know, they're all being told that they got to hunker down and, and do this research. And, um, and it's, it's extensive research. I mean, you, I spent four hours just gathering all the uh, stuff that I needed to gather. And it's not even the entire game. It's like the first phase. So this is a, this is a meaty demo. And um, you can tell. And I, I think that, that this game will be finished. And that's, you know, that could be a risky prediction with RPG Maker games. A lot of them never get done. But uh, just based on the amount of effort he's already put into it, um, I'm pretty confident that it'll get done. And I'll be looking forward to that. But in the meantime, we're still watching these uh, early cutscenes. And this is, he's at his like big console, and he's just trying to um, to connect to, to anybody and just see, you know, how isolated they really are. And the answer turns out to be very isolated. Um, and you can issue all your daily commands from this console if you want, if you're feeling like, you know, very shy. But uh, you get more out of the game, definitely, if you um, go outside and, not outside, but like go outside the room and uh, talk to everybody on a daily basis. Uh, it's pretty well done. It's kind of like a darker version of Homework Salesman, if anybody's played that. Um, not quite as in-depth, but same sort of day-to-day -day thing. And that, that stuff is... Um, it's pretty popular. It's pretty fun. You wouldn't necessarily think it would be, but people generally like that a lot. Um, so, this this part's about over, and if you want to uh, get a sense of what the research process is like, then I encourage you to download this game and play it, because it is quite good. Alright, talk to you guys later. Peace.